How are you going? Okay, good. Hey guys, and when I say guys, I literally mean guys and not the catch-all term for everybody because I have a head count on who watches these and they're both, you know, guys, male, boys. So, if I, I hope I don't have any... My foot is bleeding! Oh, shoot! I don't have any, like, super feminist, sexist people out there who are going to get you know, offended by me saying guys, but it's, it's, it's the truth. It's the honest truth. Um, right now I'm just kind of chilling. I woke up at 12 because I'm awesome. I sleep through the middle of summer. But I'm in a dilemma because I want to go to the mall. But it's boring to go to the mall alone. And the mall has Barnes and Nobles. Which I will easily spend like two or three hours in, and I don't want to make someone wait for me while I'm in there forever. But there's no winning. There's no winning. There's never any winning. There's uh, it's a terrible habit that that saying. But there's no winning. Um, what else was there? There was something else that I needed to say. I don't know. I'm not doing anything. I don't feel like doing anything. I'm doing laundry. Oh, laundry! Yeah. Because, yeah, uh, uh, I don't know, maybe someone would be like, oh, she can do laundry, oh, that's, 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 that's hot, uh, I, <laughs> I don't know, um, but I don't, there's nothing to do, because I can't paint, I can't draw, actually, I might be able to paint, I don't know, but I can't draw, I can't color, I can't shade, I can't do all these things, it's too hot to go for a run, I don't want to go for a bike ride, because I need music, and so, on that note, if you send me music, it'll be like a donation pool for music. Just send me stuff to have on my iPod so I can have good stuff so I can listen to music and not go insane. And, well, maybe you want me to go insane because then it'd be more fun here. But uh, I don't like listening to the same songs over and over again. And I have a tendency of listening to songs that I like and then killing them. And that's no fun in the long run. So... Send me music and we'll be buddies. Yeah. <laughs> um. What else is there? On that, on music, on note of music, I feel kind of guilty because I was on Facebook for like three seconds this morning, and it was enough to be like, any notifications? No. What's on my Facebook in the corner of my Facebook? Pendulum. Hmm. Just broke up. And now I feel guilty, kind of, because I like Knife Party, and Knife Party is like two-thirds of pendul Pendulum. And, well, now Pendulum is no more, so now I feel guilty for liking the two-thirds of it that exists, because I feel like it might have had something to influence that. And, uh, yeah. It, I don't know what the, uh, It's weird. It's really weird. Especially looking back, because I have so many fond memories of... Well, maybe not, like, them, but their music. And, yes. I was going to hoop to one of their songs. That's so sad. I met my, my little brother type, and I bonded because of a song. It's not right. It's not right. My best friend never got to see them, and he was so upset because they don't come to the United States. And now he won't get to see them because they don't exist anymore. So it's really just... I don't know, it's disappointing, I guess. Um, but yeah. Um, you guys need to, like, send me topics or something to talk about, because otherwise I just go off weirdly, and they don't make sense, and they don't connect, but that's okay, because my, mar my, my mind or my brain, not these brines, I keep trying to combine words a lot. I don't like it, because it makes me feel really dumb, because I look really dumb, and it's not, ugh, it's not fun. Not fun at all. But, um. Uh, so every time I say but, um, I laugh because there's, on How I Met Your Mother, there's a drinking game where every time she says but, um, they have to take a shot. And so every time I say but, um, I think about that and then I kind of just, like, laugh a little bit. People think I'm crazy. But I guess we'll live with that. I don't. Uh, Yes, people should send me ideas and topics. Someone should send me, like, yes, topics that I should talk about. Because otherwise, nothing happens here. 
and nothing happens here for you guys because I don't do anything. I was supposed to go to the beach, but I didn't go to the beach because they're gone. They're gone. They're gone. And I don't know when they'll be back, so I'm just going to chill here. Um, kind of sweat a little bit. <laughs> That's cute, right? I'm going to sweat because I'm in a sweatshirt or a sweater. Whoever's super anal retention about this can tell me because it's a pullover. And there's a difference, and I always get yelled at for it, but I'm like, really, it's a sweater. It's whatever I feel like calling it today because it pretty much does the same thing. So just deal with it. Really? You know what I'm talking about. It's like when people go off on tangents about gauges versus plugs and stretch lobes versus gauge gears. It's like, you know what they're talking about. It's just like, ain't isn't a word, but we know what you're talking about. It's like, really? Why correct people if you don't understand? I mean, I could understand if it was a foreign language, and you understand, and it could be taken as something else, which happens quite a bit in Spanish class, because, what is it, there, there was one word, um, it was supposed to be, like, um, eggs. Uh, yeah, it was supposed to be eggs, but it can be taken as balls, and that would be really interesting. I would like some eggs for breakfast! You'd like some balls for breakfast? What the heck is wrong with you? That's disgusting. Why would you say that in public? We're a restaurant. We're a classy, fine, fancy thing. Why are you... Ugh, you disgusting little shun! And just... Bleh. And it wouldn't work. It wouldn't work. And, um... What is it, like, chupalo? Chupalo means shut up, but it's also like... Uh... It's like those, 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 those ladies things. Nylons. Nylons? Oh, that's it. Nylons are weird. Um, but yes, is uh, we understand what you're talking about. This is an industrial or a scaffold or whatever. We get it. Don't go all pretentious on me. We understand what you're trying to say. And uh, it's really funny because half the people who get really mad about the gauged and stretched slopes and trugs and whatever. They have these tiny holes, like, you know, they have, like, eights or sixes, and they're, like, they're being all pretentious about it, and, like, and they're, like, I'm so high and mighty because I have these little holes, and you just have normal, pierced ears. Want to fight? Stupid, stupid, want to be people. Uh, yes. I have, um, I, I guess I have. I don't really have anger, but I have a lot of... I'm going to poke a lot of fun at you. And I realized last night as I was talking to someone, my sense of humor is warped. And, like, I like to poke fun at people. But it's not... Okay, maybe it's not warped. But it's... It's, um... It's a, it's kind of a low blow if you don't know me. Like, there was, a, there was this one kid I was talking to, and he has a heart problem. So I was talking to him, and he's like, I have to, I, I die, like, every once in a while, my heart just stops, and then I'm back to life. And he's like, I'm like, you're a zombie! And the, the, and the um, the doctors, the necromancers, they just resurrected you from the dead! Dude, you're like Iron Man! And I was, I, I kind of beat the, I, I kind of beat it with a stick, and, but I, I, I had to shovel check, I'm like, is this, is this too mean? I mean, I think he's laughing, he's really dorky, but, um, I'm not sure, is this too mean? <laughs> and yesterday, um, yeah, I just, I like, uh, it doesn't work <laughs> so well if you don't know me, because, yes. I mean, I have light humor too, but just the, the, the heavier stuff is more fun. <laughs> I blame my dad. That's alright, because my dad's awesome! Um, there was something else that I was going to say on um, kind of the same subject. Light humor, sarcasm. Um. Mm -hmm. Can't remember it. Oh! There was this one time. So, sarcasm is an interesting thing. I have this one friend who's super sarcastic, and 
it took me forever to be able to distinguish like between when he was serious and when he was just being silly. And the moment that I realized that I was only just starting to get it, I was at the gas station. And so I gave him my card, or my mom's card, actually, technically, I guess. And we were just talking. And he's like, ha, 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 your card's denied. I'm like, oh, ha, 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 I'll see you later. Ha, <laughs> ha. No, really. I'm like, oh. Um, well, now what? Uh, <laughs> trying to flag down my mom, but it's just, it's interesting. And, yes. But, really, I, ugh, I have no, ugh, sound effects just everywhere. Just, just being plummeted by sound effects. But, yes, and, no, maybe so, ugh, ugh. I'm going, no, the, I'll do nothing somewhere else where it's not as easily embarrassing.